Hey guys, it's Jack from Rethink Tech, back with a 3D printing video. So my 3D printing videos have gotten a lot of views, and in the first video of, of this playlist, I was talking about how I'm going to show a video of the upgrades I made. And so this video, I'm going to show you some of the upgrades that I uh, did on my 3D printer right when I got it out of the box and built it. So I'm starting off with this LCD screen. I got this off of Thingiverse, I'll put a link in the description below. And this printed, it was a long print, uh, it's 100% solid, it took about like 6 to 8 hours I think, but it looks awesome and is so much better than the flimsy one that came with my Sun Hokey Rep Rap Prusa i3. Um, On to the next thing, I printed a Z end stop holder because the other one was held in with just one screw. Yes, one screw. So this took about an hour and a half to print, it's not the best quality but it works and uh, it's way more solid than the other acrylic one. So on to the next thing. This is a, uh, it's a funnel that funnels the air from my second fan down to the tip of the extruder. And so this basically funnels all the air um, down to one point instead of just going everywhere. Now this thing, uh, the, the blue object, I made myself. I'll link this down below. Um, or if I can, I'll find a similar one on Thingiverse. Um, but this attaches to the, the platform that comes off the x-axis um, and it basically holds the fan um, to the, the extruder plate and it just keeps it sturdy and I can move it up and down and around. So these things uh, were the first thing that I printed. I needed these. So the, the plate that holds the extruder to the x-axis, um, it was so, so flimsy and I couldn't print anything. So these I found on Thingiverse, and they printed in like 15 minutes. I made a duplicate, flipped it around, and I printed these, um, I printed two of them. They fit perfectly, and now it does not wobble at all. So, um, if you can see under here, the, the Y-axis, the, the heated bed, the acrylic piece that attached the belt to the actual heated bed was super, super flimsy and wobbly, so I made, uh, two little T-shaped objects that clip in there. Um, it fits perfectly um, and stops it from wobbling, which is the important part. Um, I'll link this down below too, and if I can't, I'll find something on Thingiverse. So this concludes the video about the upgrades I printed for my 3D printer. Um, and all of these are super, super useful, and I highly suggest printing these out first so your printer will work properly and uh, print the best quality that it can. So I'm using a Sun Hokey Rep Rap Prusa i3. All of the things linked in the description will work. They were they were also work for probably any Rep Rap Prusa i3. If you need any help, please comment down below. I will make sure to answer. So thanks guys for watching. My name is Jack from Rethink Tech and I'll see you guys in the next video.